All right, I'm uh, going to be working on the mounds today. I'm going to be working on the mounds today, sketching them in and getting the stencils cut and hopefully I'll get around to starting to paint them. They're going to be very distant mountains. Uh, no, you know, any, no detailed features on them or anything like that. And uh, the way I usually do it, and if you've been following some of my videos, some of my other videos on backdrop painting, I usually start off by taping together some blank sheets of paper, then taping them up on the wall where uh, I'm going to be doing my work and just uh, sketching. Sketch the mountains in, okay? And I do it this way just because I don't want to actually put pencil on the wall and get, get things marked up in case I don't like what I do. I can erase it on here and do something different or throw it out if I mess things up too much. And then uh, what I do after that, I take this and transfer the patterns I put cut it out of cardstock. You'll see me do that, you know, and I like I like that method because of the clean, sharp angles I can get with the knife that uh, I feel I couldn't get as well with uh, doing it freehand. So, uh, but anyway, that is my preferred method. And uh, there's obviously simpler ways of doing this. You know, if you want to freehand it, that's fine too. Or uh, use pre-made backdrops, some that are just pictures and stick them up on the wall, things like that. There's tons of stuff you can do. But uh, this is how I usually get things done. So let me go ahead and get these uh, taped together. stock here. I'm going to tape this together and then uh, cut out the profiles for my mountains.
Okay, what I'm going to do next is uh, go outside and spray some of this artist adhesive on the back and tack this first stencil up against the wall and start doing some painting. So. This uh, first background mount was sprayed here, and uh, I forgot to turn the camera. I forgot to turn the camera on, so that's why I didn't uh, see anything happen. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna try something a little bit different. I'm gonna take a little brush here. I'm just doing some quick highlighting to indicate sun or maybe even snow on the mountains, and I'm gonna overspray it a little bit with uh, white mist, make it look more distant. So. 